Usually when you buy a new computer, Windows 10 and 11 come pre-installed with a load of software, including a free trial of antivirus. Now, my advice is that you should remove that immediately. Out of the box, you usually get something like McAfee Total Protection. It's free for the first month, and then after that, it's like 40 or 50 bucks a year, which is fine, I suppose. I'm not really a big fan of software that's being bundled in with your new device, because what happens is in 30 days, like you feel like you're being held to ransom. You get big, scary messages like, protect your device. Don't put yourself at risk, renew today. And it's usually bundled in with some kind of two-year tie-in, just like, here. Now, what these paid for products are trying to hide from you is that the Windows 10 and now Windows 11 has a perfectly good antivirus built in. I say perfectly good, it's actually award-winning and it's free. In fact, in this year's Trusted Review Awards, Microsoft Defender won Best Antivirus. There'll be a link down there for you to have a look. But it beat the likes of Avast, Kaspersky, Bitdefender and ESET. And also, if you check out the independent reviews from AV Test, again, link down below, they continually test the top 21 antivirus products. And you'll see that Microsoft Defender consistently comes out in the top ranked products. I'm not saying it's absolutely the best on their list every time, but it's definitely top ranked. So I guess the big question is a free antivirus actually any good? Well, look, when it comes to an antivirus, you want three things. I mean, virus protection, obviously, that it doesn't slow down your machine and make it so you, you know, unusable. Um, and then it doesn't constantly annoy you with pop-ups, controls, questions. You just want it to just get on with things in the background and make me safer. That's what I want you to do. Let's have a look at that independent review of Defender. So have a look here. In the most recent tests you can see for July and August, you can see the Defender protected against 100% of virus attacks and zero day threats. That's better than the industry average right here. But here's the killer. When it comes to performance, slowing down your PC, 5% when launching popular websites, 0% slow down of frequently used applications, and an average 8% of slowing down standard applications. Okay, oof, have a look at this. 43% slowdown when you're installing applications. But you know what? I can live with that. That's not exactly a daily activity. Now, let's compare that with the paid-for antivirus that came with this computer right here. First off, it didn't manage to protect against all zero-day attacks. Understandable, I guess, but we know we can do better. A 16% slowdown on web browsing. That's three times slower than Defender performed. 0% slowdown on frequent apps, that's great, and 9% slowdown of standard software. Actually, that's really good, just slightly slower than Microsoft Defender. And then 34% slowdown when installing new apps. Actually, it beat Defender there, that's really nice. So, given the performance and protection is overall better on Microsoft Defender, why would you pay for antivirus? I mean, yes, if you absolutely need to drive every ounce of performance out of your machine, then there are some paid for antivirus programs which will perform better for that single use case. And you know what? A big quick shout out to ESET there for overall their best day-to-day -day performance when we reviewed these things. Now look, Microsoft invests a billion dollars a year on cybersecurity research. And I'll be honest, that doesn't all go into antivirus, fine. But overall ecosystem of security research, it's a billion dollars a year. To put that into perspective, that's more than the entire turnover of each of those competitors we saw in the Trusted Review Awards. Have a look here. You can see that they don't even turn over a billion dollars, let alone have that to invest in their antivirus. Now look, I do get it. Microsoft didn't used to have the best reputation for security, and the thought of using the built-in antivirus might be laughable for some old-school techies. But Microsoft Defender is a fantastic piece of software. It's built-in, it's free, it doesn't significantly slow down your machine, and it protects you from viruses. What else do you want? Well, that's it for this video, guys. We will see you next time.